So this is kind of a typical bedroom home studio situation, and I thought it would be a good idea to take a closer look at how the sound travels in the room and what the microphone captures. So the sound source, his voice, his mouth is speaking, and that microphone is going to be picking up the direct, pure voice. That is the sound coming right from his voice going directly to the microphone. But his voice continues in the room, right? It continues forward beyond the microphone and hits the wall in front of him, bounces back, but is rejected, right? It's rejected by the rejection side of the microphone. So the microphone does a pretty good job of not picking up this reflected sound, but it keeps going, bounces off behind the walls. So it bounces, hit this wall, behind here, back, and then the reflection sounds go back and into the microphone. They leak into the sensitive part of the microphone. And what happens is these reflections that are coming back into the microphone are happening at a slight delay. 